felt like just a matter of time before Tom Herman would get that Texas squad going. And guys, as we continue with winners and losers from the weekend, we go to loser, which is specifically about defense and specifically about Oklahoma giving up 48 points to Texas. Joey, are you surprised as we hear that Mike Stoops has been fired as a defensive coordinator? Are you surprised with the timing of this? I'm always surprised when coaches get fired. I guess if you're looking at Oklahoma's situation, they have a bye this week. Uh, their defense was trending in the wrong direction with the amount of yards they gave up to Baylor, and then they give up a ton of points and yards to Texas. And so it always throws me off, and I hate to see it happen when coaches are fired midseason. But if you're going to do it, the bye week is the best time to do it. It is, and what bothers me most if I'm a player on that Oklahoma defense, I have to have a certain level of accountability, too. Because if you look and watch Oklahoma over the last six weeks, the schemes have been there. Yeah, there have been a few mistakes. There's been a busted assignment here and there. But the main reason why this defense has struggled is because they can't tackle. If you watch them against Iowa State, like right here, they miss six or seven tackles before the guy walks into the end zone. Every single year when you put on the tape of Oklahoma, they're getting run over by offensive players, and they're not wrapping up in the secondary. That's not Mike Stoops' fault. So, yeah, if you're going to make a change, it has to be today. But these players need to tackle better and be more sound in their fundamentals, or the defense isn't going to get better.